Greetings and welcome to the Astronomy Picture of the Day podcast. Today's picture for August 9th of 2024 is titled A Perseid Below. So what do we see here? Well, here we see an image taken from the International Space Station back in 2011. Now it was taken almost exactly then 13 years ago and it shows one of the Perseid meteors and you can see that streak across the front across the middle of the image and that is a tiny bit of material being vaporized in Earth's upper atmosphere and that's what a meteor is a meteor is just a small bit of debris generally left behind by a comet or asteroid as it orbits the sun and when Earth happens to pass through the orbit orbit of that object, some of those pieces of material will be picked up by Earth's atmosphere and will accelerate into the atmosphere at high speeds and will be vaporized and they, we see that glow trail as it vaporizes itself. Now we can also see a number of other things here including of course our Earth and we can clearly see the curvature of Earth. So while the International Space Station is in a low Earth orbit we can't see the entire Earth at one time from it but we can definitely see the curvature of the spherical Earth there. We can also see the atmosphere off in the distance up above there. So the atmosphere, those upper layers actually visible as well. And we can see the dividing between day and night. We can see the day side coming off over toward the upper right hand side. So we look down on the nighttime side of Earth, but we can see the daylight up above over there on the right. Now the little bit of the space station that we do see uh, up to the upper right hand side as well. So here we have again one of those Perseid meteors and this coming weekend is a good chance to be able to see more of them. This will be the annual Perseid meteor shower and we will see far more of them especially if you look after about midnight or so. We'll be at first quarter moon and the, when the moon is set by about midnight or so then you'll be able to see more meteors. Why is that? Well, the moon tends to brighten up the sky. That doesn't mean you can't see meteors when the moon is in the sky, but the overall sky brightness is a little bit more and it takes the fainter meteors are then going to be next to impossible to see. So the darker the sky is, the darker your sight, your sight is, and the darker, the less the moon is illuminated, the more meteors you will have a chance to see. So again, that's something to look forward to just this coming weekend, uh, you looking probably in the very early morning hours. So after the moon has set, but well before dawn, before the sun starts to brighten the sky as well, you have a chance to see a number of these meteors or shooting stars going across the sky. So that was our picture of the day for August 9th of 2024. It was titled A Perseid Below. We'll be back again tomorrow for the next picture. So until then, have a great day everyone, and I will see you in class.